Artificial sunlight is the use of a light source to simulate sunlight where the unique characteristics of sunlight are needed, but where sufficient natural sunlight is unavailable or infeasible. A device used to simulate sunlight is a solar simulator. <laughs> Composition of natural sunlight The spectrum of electromagnetic radiation striking the Earth's atmosphere is 100 to 1 million nanometers nanometer. This can be divided into five regions in increasing order of wavelengths Ultraviolet C UVC range, 100 to 290 nanometers Ultraviolet B UVB range, 290 to 320 nanometers Ultraviolet A UVA range 320 to 400 nanometers visible range or light 400 to 700 nanometers infrared range it is further divided into three types on the basis of wavelength infrared A 700 to 1400 nanometers infrared B 1400 to 3000 nanometers Infrared C, 3000 to 1 million nanometers. Topic: Applications. Topic: Illumination. It has been claimed that artificial light sources that provide the light of the closest possible spectrum as provided by the Sun have beneficial effects on health and productivity. This technology is known as full-spectrum lighting. <laughs> <laughs> light therapy Artificial sunlight is found useful in treating and preventing seasonal affective disorder also known as winter depression, which brings about depressive symptoms specifically in winter, and delayed sleep phase syndrome, in which the circadian rhythm is disturbed, and the individual tends to fall asleep much later than they would desire. Artificial sunlight may also be useful in prevention, or minimizing the severity of jet lag. Aquarium lighting Different corals in a reef aquarium require different lighting conditions. Most of the corals are symbiotically dependent upon zooxanthellae—a type of algae. It is the zooxanthellae that require light to perform photosynthesis, and they provide the coral polyps with simple carbohydrates. In addition to the above techniques of lighting, a new technique employs light-emitting diodes LEDs. The advantage of this technology is that the various parameters of lighting such as warmth and coolness of color are microprocessor controlled that make it possible to simulate daybreak, sunset, and even the various phases of moon. However, this technology is relatively expensive. Also, some animals like the red-eared slider turtle benefit from having those lights fitted on their aquariums. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Product testing. Testing the efficacy of sunscreens requires the use of solar simulators. Manufacturers of solar cells must test the overall efficiency of the cells. They require to be tested indoors, which has traditionally been performed using mostly sulfur plasma lamps or xenon arc lamp. Within the automotive industry, solar simulation tests are used to ensure automotive system reliability and functionality. Artificial sunlight solar simulators are also used for sunlight exposure testing and of color fastness and material stability for textile, plastics and paints. <laughs> 